Hello everybody and welcome back to Electric Mindset. We're gonna jump right back into Amnesia here. Uh, I'm sort of terrified that the last episode of this was just not cool. Hello? Anybody wanna rip my face off? No? That's great. What's in here? More monsters? Naked bodies? That's my cue, folks! Mother, I don't wanna leave without you! Hurry, child. You must go. Find Gabriel, the Outrider, and tell him to alert the King's men. There was Come. children in here? Come to. Please, we don't have time to make the hole any wider. The hole? But... Someone is coming. Hurry! I'll cover the hole with the bed. Everything will be fine. I promise you. I should explore this whole area before I jump down there. That can be my serious escape route. Like, if shit's going down, then I'm just gonna go right down into the hole. I don't know if... Locked, very corroded, and weak. Hammer! I mean, something else is needed. Like, what? Where is she? Where did she go? No! I won't tell! I'll never tell you! Oh, a chipper! Making things nice! Worse. Look, I can use that with the no hammer. Place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what horrors await down there. That sounds like me. Sounds like Daniel. So, can I come by? Yes! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! So wait. All that was to refill half my lantern? There's nothing else in here? I feel like there should be more. You know what? You know what? Not questioning it. Not doing it. I'm happy with just getting more lantern oil. Oh, look at that! More lantern oil. So, have I explored all there is to explore all over here then? I went down here, I got the absolute shit scared out of me. Uh. Oh. More lantern oil. Okay, so that's locked. Shit. 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 Where did I go? It was this room. Was it? Ugh! All of that. All of those tinder boxes wasted because of friggin' this garbage. The hole is too narrow to slip through. Yes! So once again, this episode is going to be a little bit longer. This time, it's my fault because I forgot to actually reset the timer. That's my fault. You can blame me for that. Oh, good. Okay, we're just going to go right into this dark, creepy, desolate tunnel. That's alright. Why not? I've already been everywhere else, so... Oh, and it bridges off. Okay. Alright. Well, I'll take right, because I'm right-handed. Come on, just a little bit more. Perfect. I should keep one of these rocks nearby, just in case I have to beat down a monster or something. Storage. I'm kind of hesitant to re to, to light any torches down here just because that gust of wind just put everything out, so... Shit. 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 Where is it? Is there not actually anything? I don't like this crap. What is this? Storage.
This is so garbage. This is stupid. Why do I put myself in this situation? Oh. Is he safe? Well, it's for his own good. I can hear. Like, something's definitely around. I can't, I don't know where, like, exactly where. Hey, anybody, help! Nope. Christ. I don't believe this. Why? I mean, why? What's he going to do to deserve this? I mean, it can't be. Do I deserve this? It wasn't my fault. I didn't have to go in there. I don't go into burning houses. He should have known better. Okay, so... It sounds like this guy was indirectly responsible for someone dying. Maybe... By the sound of things, ran into a burning house. Oh, hello! I know what happened here. This guy died from autoerotic asphyxiation. Asphyxiation. Tricky words. Hey, buddy. Hey, how are you doing over there, huh? I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna put this on you. Well, alright. You're just naked as naked can get. So, that's good for you. You live free, buddy. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna close this door just because. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast... I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I... They are dead. Daniel's taking it pretty hard of all the people that died on that expedition. He's, uh... Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me! Alright, alright, we can do this! We can do this! Oh, shit! Hey, you didn't waste any time! Hey, gorgeous! Run! Sick dodge! Sick dodge! Run! Run, 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 run! Run, run, run! I don't even know where I'm going. I don't even know. I don't even know where I'm going. Oh, you've got to be- Oh, 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 oh run in the other way! Run! Run! Oh, boy. I'm just meant to die right now. Run. This is probably where we came. This is where we came. If he's there, maybe the other monster's gone. Soon we'll be ready. Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me! Go this way, then. Jesus! I feel like I, I'm sorry everyone I am not I just can't read that right now he escaped where is he now <laughs> I don't want to go out there anymore oh man this is taking a turn for the worse I got <laughs> you know it's bad when you're standing in a cell with a bucket Oh man, my lamp oil's running out. Oh, like I don't I don't even know. I don't even know how long I should wait or like what my alternatives are. There's nothing in here for me to this diaries uh there's a Christian perch Marco Polo ends in here since it's burning burst okay so there's nothing like significantly important in there 
You know what? There's only one way for us to know for sure, right? We gotta just go. What? What? Where? Ah! 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 Oh God! Fuck! Run! Run! Oh! I hate everything. I hate everything. This is bullshit. Hey, you Don't slow me. Stop. Don't slow me. It's too dangerous. I'm telling Gabriel. I doubt that very much. It won't budge. It won't budge. And the padlock's an excellent control. Okay. All right. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're okay. We're okay. I'm just gonna, you know, Daniel's going crazy right now. Dan's going crazy. I, uh, I didn't get hit, which is friggin' shocking. Yeah, you better get out of here, you son of a bitch. Okay, he's gone. He's gone, that won't budge. We're getting the hell out of here. We're getting the hell out of here. I am so done. I am so done. Just... Why? Oh, it's the only way! It's the... What is that? Why does he sound so... Ah! Ah! Oh, no! Oh, no! Gotta get out! Ah! Ah! It's fucking running at me! What the fuck is this bullshit? Oh, I'm so fucked. He's right behind me. Oh, fuck, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. You son of a bitch. Come on, you bastard. Come on. Uh, oh, when I do, what the fuck? Oh my god. What the hell? I'm fine. He scared the shit out of me. Where the hell am I? Oh, I'm only like... My head is pounding, hands are shaking. They save me right near this door. Is he still just creeping on the edge there? No, he's gone. Uh, we might end up dying again just because I need to know... I need to gauge, like, is he gone? Oh, man. That was just so friggin' terrible. Oh, man, I haven't had a scare like that in a good long while. Okay. Okay, that's ways clear. That way's clear. Tinderbox. Oh man, what a game. What a game. It, this game is absolutely scared the sh crap out of me. So, the monster that I saw before came from down that hallway. I'm going to take that as a sign in video game logic that I was headed in the right direction. Oh, look at that. Just wonderful. There's a room here. 4th of August, 1839. The nightmares woke me in the early morning, and for a moment, I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him in the parlor. As we drank our tea, Alexander began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found, I said I didn't care about its powers and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this, as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb and eventually suffer death. So Alexander's just really talking up all this protection stuff. Saying he can take care of him, he can take protect Daniel, deal with all this orb stuff. 
Oh man, what a scare. I haven't even been paying attention to the, my timer. How much time do we have in this episode? Oh, we have plenty of time. Oh, well, smart one, man. I need to stop touching things before I really figure out what they're all about. Uh, I don't have anything to collect it. But a glass container is an ideal vessel. Okay, um... There's no other container in this room. And just in time, I got some lamp oil. An ideal vessel. What, what like, causes the monsters to run at me? Like, I had no problem running away from them before. I got this nice, well-lit hallway. Look how pretty it is. Okay, what's in here? Won't budge, of course it won't. A padlock in excellent condition. Kitchen. Storage. Let's follow these signs to storage. Maybe in storage you have like a glass bottle or something. I could probably stop using this so much just because I I've lit so many of these torches. Nothing down there. That is pitch friggin' black. Okay. Oh, yeah, there's nothing for me to light. Okay. Storage. Looks like storage is this way. Oh, yeah, this is where the one monster came, uh. Lamp oil. God damn, I cannot believe how it's friggin' scared I got at that monster. Cell area four. That's... I don't give a shit. Padlock in excellent condition. Oh! Storage! Storage! Found the storage! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! That's the, what I want. Now, a glass bottle. Oh, look at that. Glass jar. Perfect. I don't see any monsters out there either, so this is, uh... This is another good thing. What do I got here? No monster. No monsters. Don't need you open. Oh, I actually hear something. So what, I die and like, all the monsters disappear? That makes me so happy. Oh, this is the kitchen. This is perfect. This is exactly where I was. Uh, this way. I should be able to put my lantern away. I've lit enough of these torches. Oh man, what a game. I'm so glad after all this time I have finally worked up the courage to play this game. You've got to be shitting me. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. Hey, Biggin! Hey, Biggie Smalls! How's it going? 
Uh, come over here. Come over here. Run! Run! <laughs> Feel my barrels. <laughs> He'll never find me in here. He'll never do it. And now he's all disoriented from that barrel. He'll never do it. He'll never do it. Oh god, please don't let him do it. My hands are like so sweaty. That was a terrible idea. Oh, I'm just... I got goosebumps. The hair on my arms is standing up. How's my health doing? A few cuts and bruises. Okay, we can handle that. Oh, what a game. Okay. It's like, how do I know? How do I know, like, when he's gone? When it's safe to go anywhere? Even more so, like, how do I know? I don't got a map. The gate out of this area is locked by a worn padlock. We know there are two, I think there's two excellent condition padlocks. Oh! Oh! The scary music stopped. The scary music's over. I hope I hope that means he's gone. Okay. Well, we can see a stairwell through here. If I follow those stairs going up, it would be right over here somewhere. Right? Right? Hey, look at the big circle I just went in. Oh man, I cannot wait to get out of here. This has been just terrifying. There was a padlock here, wasn't there? How, what condition is it in? Excellent condition. It won't budge. So, we gotta, when we encounter a monster, we gotta run, take quick turns, find the nearest room to hide in, and just duck down. Wait for the music to stop. But throwing, after I threw the, uh, the barrel at him, I seem to be faster. I don't know if that's just... Oh, this was the storage area. So what's in the opposite direction? Oh. Oh. In excellent condition. Piss off. Okay. We've been to the kitchen. We went that way. Let's go this way. Oh! A fortified with a metal padlock. Okay. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Get me out of here. Oh, I think I made it. I think I'm okay. I don't think they can follow me through doors like that. Oh, and just in time, so too. So, you used the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring, and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, 
and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. Alright, everyone. That was a crazy episode. We'll end it here. As always, take care of yourself and try and stay in an metric mindset. See you later, everybody. Thanks for watching my video. If you liked it, then subscribe to help the Electric Mindset community grow and to see more great videos.